what they say in the meeting. It's about what they say after the meeting. So let's decide what they're going to say. It'll be simple enough. Like what? We appreciate the president's invitation and welcome him to the cause of bipartisanship. And I'll end the press conference. CJ. Are you going to welcome him to the cause of bipartisanship? What's the problem? I think CJ's objecting to the implication that we got there first. Yes. How about we all agree on a need for a renewed spirit of bipartisanship? The meeting was positive. Yes. Friendly, frank, and productive. Yes. And we're certain our goals can be met under the president's leadership. No way. What's the problem? I think what my aide is objecting to is the implication it's the president's leadership under which our goals will be met. The meeting was positive, friendly, frank, and productive. Well, this spicy bouquet that suggests a fine Merlot. <laughs> the press will be at the northwest entrance. Assuming we're done at 10.30, the majority leader will speak and take questions. The minority leader, then CJ will answer questions 20 minutes later in the briefing room. If all goes well, we I should gotta go stop you. Room. Why in the briefing room? That's where I brief. The majority leader's briefing first and outside. You're doing it last, in back of a podium, and in front of a blue curtain with a big picture of the White House. And the majority leader will be doing it in front of the actual White House. No, he'll be doing it on the Capitol steps. Traditionally, these kinds of things are done in front of the White House. Traditionally, the person in my job has cared what's traditional. The president's not going to want to end a bipartisan breakfast with the Republicans speaking from one place and the Democrats speaking... And the majority leader's not going to stand at a cardboard podium in your front yard while you stand in the White House press briefing room, and with good reason. Which is? I don't think they're on equal footing. My boss and your boss? Yes. I don't think they are either. CJ. And the majority leader's going to brief outside. If the majority leader wants to skip breakfast, there'll be more pancakes for the rest of us. My press room can write about why. Oh, you can't blame a girl for trying. You need me? Can I borrow her for a moment? We'll wait. <sighs> These rules are crap. The guidelines? We're working with CJ right now. I could care less who says what in what order I'm talking about, what we say when we sit down. You've got concerns? Yes, I do. Name one. The president prefers maple syrup from New Hampshire. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Then we better meet on this. Breakfast tomorrow. What should I wear? I don't give a damn. I've heard different. 9.45. So we got that straight. Where were we? You were giving me and my staff an ultimatum. 